Hello everyone and welcome back to Calavora's Gunslinger. Moving right along to the next mission. I should have just... See, the thing is, I don't know whether I'm going to have a cutscene or not, so I can't hit that button until I start the episode. Anyway. We'll get those suckers! It took me a couple of days to track the Daltons down. They can't get away with this! And in that time, a whole posse of local vigilantes offered to lend a hand. All right, well, uh, let me tweak the audio real quick because I couldn't do that before either. They seemed as determined as me to find those outlaws. But as we headed into those swamps, it was like I had my own private army. There was swamps? no way those boys were getting away this I time. I don't think this counts as swamps. Although, maybe that's an indicator they originally intended for this to be a swamp area. They did say Missouri. Eh, I don't know. I see you, explosive barrel. Do I shoot you now or later? It was early fall, right? Beautiful time of year. At least you had the weather on your side. Not by my recollection. It was damp and foggy as hell. That's a great transition. Do you want to get shot, Tree? Flying those colors around here? Anyway, before we go any further, I should do this. Um... Pressing and holding Q would eat up all your concentration to remain nearby by enemies for execution with perfect headshots. Alright, now I get my upgraded rifle. So that's neat. Right, it was we... tough to stay on a true course, so we kept an eye out for landmarks. I already saw that. You didn't have to drag my camera over there. Boy, that, uh... That buzzing noise is realistically autumn. annoying. The maple trees were in full color. Red as blood. The rains that year were torrential. Waypoint so indicator disables for the mission. Interesting. The vigilantes had spread out wide, and pretty soon I couldn't see anybody. See you there, buddy. Because, uh, you got your torch. Phasing through the... Unless... Nope, I was wrong. Whoop. Alright, one of three. I think we are officially into the parts of the game I've never seen before, so... Bury them in the swamp! You let them where they stand! Except for some some bitches ahead of me wanting to do me harm. So I had to face them alone. I wondered why my compatriots didn't come running when they heard the shots. Where even are you? You're such a bad shot. Oop. That's what I get. Run in my mouth. Uh. I'm ending you. Are you? Don't even know where you are. Okay, what the shit? 
What the hell? Oh my god, you're way up there. How the shit am I supposed to see you up there? Wasn't sure if that was the same guy or not, but apparently it wasn't. So did you find the Daltons? Not yet, but I did have the questionable pleasure of meeting a few of their friends. Wow, that didn't catch any of them with that explosion. Very unfortunate. Running low on rifle ammo. something. I don't remember shooting this guy. Maybe somebody else did it for me. I'm getting more, quite a more severe stutter time, now. So they attracted all manner of riffraff to their cause. That guy had a lot more health. I wasn't bothering to look at his name. I just saw that he had a health bar. farm here. This place sucks. Besides, I don't think you own the deed to this place. Nor am I sure why you would uh, want to claim to. Point B and I was under serious attack. You ready for a belly punch? And my reinforcements was nowhere to be seen. are you? Hold on. I said a, saw a red reticle in here for a second. Man, fuck you. What the hell? That's not fair. Fuck it. I gotta get in cover or something. That could have gone worse. Oh, these bugs. Even fake bugs, not fun. Well, luckily, a barn materialized as if right before my eyes. I scrambled up top to get a better view. Not entirely sure I believe that. Where's that ammo? Is it all the way back here? I'm not sure whether to continue with the rifle or take the, uh, the shotgun. I really haven't used the shotgun at all. I haven't fired the sawed off once. Wait, why did I run all the way back here when there's an ammo crate in here? I'm stupid. Uh, 
What could possibly go wrong? But just ended up falling inside. So, how did you get out? The barn doors was open. About right then, I saw some suspicious characters running through the bushes. Of course, I followed them. But that goddamn swamp was like a goddamn maze, and pretty soon I had no goddamn idea where I was. Um. So I just started walking, and pretty soon I... Oh. I'm very confused whether... Steve! Steve! Uh, huh? Oh, uh, no, 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 I'm listening. Indians surrounded me from all sides. What? Indians? They were Indians? No. I just wanted to make sure Steve was paying attention. <laughs> now, where was I? You were following the Daltons through a swamp? That's right. See, Steve? Dwight's paying attention. No, I, I'm listening. I, I, I was just uh, resting my eyes. So, where was I? The Daltons. Right. See, there's a reason so many outlaw gangs are made up of brothers. Being a brother is a very sacred thing. It's a bond like no other. That looks like it's probably where I'm due to go. I do appreciate that they actually do slow you down in the water, and it seems like as the water gets deeper, it, you get even slower. It's kind of impressive. find the damn Daltons? Not yet, but I did find a few of their cousins. You Kansans breed like rabbits. More Smiths or Heimhoffers or who knows what. Somebody kill but hell, what's more important than family? How he threw that after his death. At least give me the opportunity to dodge and return fire, because that guy was gonna kill me. I don't like the random spawning from places they couldn't possibly be. I don't feel like that's necessary. These these levels are well enough designed that that's really not needed. You like running your mouth, don't you? Oh, it's got something over his, over the front of it. Apparently I can't shoot through. You can't get me. Keep shooting, I don't mind. They do basically get one free hit on me, which I don't love, but eh, not the end of the world.
Anyone else? done I think we're all right all right let's backtrack here Just a, a lot of those paths seem to be leading nowhere yeah well, it was worth a try man you don't have to berate me for it Is definitely starting to become a little harder to follow where uh, where people are. That's it for you. Ready to meet your maker. Uh oh, someone's got a shotgun. What, what? Oh, God, I couldn't even see you. Alright, rifle is the wrong choice against those guys. Interesting, I can't pick up his shotgun. Anything over here? Oh, dynamite. And I do have a point to spend. Um, yeah. Maybe I shouldn't have focused on one tree the whole time. That's all right, though. I made it through. I just wanted to do the rifle upgrade. Okay, nothing in here. This doesn't look like a... Uh-huh. Oh, no, that isn't a guy, it's just a plant. I was... And that's when I saw it. A goddamn steamboat. A steamboat? In a swamp? Yeah, Steve, but this wasn't much more than a wreck, really. But how'd a damn steamboat end up in the swamps? Yes, it floated off during the flood of 89. Now, was it a stern wheeler or, or a side wheeler? What, what? Does that really make a difference, Steve? It was a steamboat with a goddamn army on board. It was then that a fusillade of bullets it? come raining down from our house. And those vigilantes who accompanied me weren't anywhere to be found. But among those men that were shooting at me, I thought I saw some familiar faces. Can I really not take that guy? There we go. Just hard to see him behind all the muzzle flash. Some. Guess when you tie dynamite to yourself, you 
Get what you deserve. I'm trying to think back. Um, huh? Huh? Um, trying to think back to my chemistry. I know that they reform. So, dynamite and TNT are not the same thing, or there are Somewhere multiple formulations, the and Wait. one is more of a catch-all term than the other. And as I recall, there's something... I think... I think dynamite used to be much more um, prone to, like, shock... Uh, like, being detonated by shock because it had a higher proportion of nitroglycerin in it. Um, whereas now, I mean, you don't want to fling it around, but, um. Sounds like you don't give up too easy. That's the kind of man I am. Oh, well, those guys can be taken out with headshots, all right. I set out right. to do something. I do it. Surrender just ain't in my nature. Plus, I'm stubborn as hell. Nope. There we are. Oops. Well, didn't mean to do that. That's all right. Some more bullets. <clears throat> Can't I rip this off and use it? You know? Because I'm such a badass. Do you have any other insults? Well, apparently I have to use the ladder. Can't just climb down. Or I can't just jump down. That was a surprisingly uh, easy room, all things considered. It's a weird place to have a wall. Everything else makes sense. That wall does not. Sorry, I have to scratch my nose here. I'm too focused on shooting dudes. Right about then, um, much to my relief, the vigilantes finally arrived. Uh -huh, Their arrived. leader motioned at a cabin in the middle of the top deck, pointing me directly at the Daltons. Convenient. I finally had them, after months of dogged pursuit. I don't believe you. Oh well, it's worth a try. <laughs> but it turned out that they had me. Uh, yep. Take them out! I'm sending you to hell! Well, I mean... That seems aggressive. The had played me like a fiddle. All, Apparently, the vigilantes were on their damn payroll. They didn't just want to shoot me. They wanted to burn me alive. But finding my way out of a burning labyrinth proved to be quite a challenge. It was a riverboat, right? I mean, it's not like it was a goddamn ocean. <laughs> yeah, but I was in a fight. Did you hear about that ship that's going to launch next year? The largest one in the world. Um, well, I'm talking about the Titanic. If you ask me, it's too blessed to I don't think it'll even flow. So uh -oh. anyway, uh -oh. these stupid Steve, they know what they're doing. They say that the Titanic is unsinkable. Oh, God. <laughs> to that steamboat, how'd you get off uh, of Mr. Breeze? I took I in a lot this. of smoke that day, so I admit my recollection might be a bit hazy. But somehow, I managed to finally disembark. It was time to settle this once and for all. Oh, hey.
Gotta appreciate that they uh, wore bright colors for me to point at. I'm a little worried about overheating this thing, although they didn't warn me about overheating. It's just something I assume with Gatling guns. About to come at me one at a time. They were in this together. Oh boy. Two brothers side by side determined to take me down. Confident that this time the odds were on their side. Um, how is this going to work? Um Well Not really sure what to to make of that unless I'm supposed to you know if I'm supposed to shoot first Sad end for those two. If they'd only known that Emmett was still alive despite his wounds. Paroled 14 years later, he moved to California and sold real estate and lived off the legend of that fateful day. And the tragic death of his two brothers. Well, that was a fun little mission. Uh, I enjoyed the set piece and everything that went along with it. That was pretty good. All right, uh, next episode, we'll go to the next mission. See you guys then.